Hi, welcome back. On this video here, I want to introduce you to string functions in PHP. And I'm not just talking about custom main string functions, I'm talking about predefined string functions. All right, this is the website here, php.net forward slash ref dot strings. Here you will find all the string functions related to PHP. As you can see here, there are many, and they all do different things. Some of them do similar things. Now, I want to just give you a couple, just show you how to use a couple here, so that way you have an idea how this works. I'm going to use a function uh, to calculate the length of characters in a string. All right, so I'm going to name this string or strings. Just string, actually, because we're not going to have strings. We're going to have a string with many different characters. And I'm just going to say, hello, student. Do you like the class? Now, keep in mind that this file here, you will find it in your exercise files. 27 underscore string underscore functions dot PHP. Now, if you have a separate folder and you're doing this in a separate folder, on your desktop, just name this strings underscore functions, okay? So, and you can actually take this template from blank.php as we've been doing so far. So keep that in mind. So I'm going to use a function here called, and let me just, I can actually use it in the echo as a matter of fact. I just can use the whole thing. It's going to call str len. And I just I can put the whole thing in the echo function right here also and just display everything on the screen if I wanted to. I'm just gonna go ahead and show you down the browser. Show you a number 35. Alright, so it has 35 characters here, including the spaces. Alright, that's one this is a built-in function, as you can see. It's not something that we made, it's something that PHP already did for us. And there are many of them. I'm just gonna show you a couple here and send you on your way to actually finding out some more. And now another one that I want to show you is echo, let's just echo it out. It's called str to upper. This is this means string to uppercase, all right? And grab this and you can have any variable name you want, of course. And if we can get this, that would be nice. As you can see here, everything is in uppercase. All right, like this. Perfect, right? I mean, there are very useful functions that we can use to do different things. I'm going to copy and paste, actually, this little piece right here, if I can get it done. <laughs> and I'm just going to say str to lower. That's another one that's just going to lowercase everything. All right. So those are a couple of functions there. There will be a lot more that you can use. If you go to the website here, like I said, you can use another function instead of echo called print. Uh, I'm going to show it to you right now. There are many of them. If you, I'm just going to look here at print. You got print F also. Right here, we click on it. It's going to give us going to say something here about what it does. It's not actually a real function. It is a language construct, so you are now required to use parentheses with its argument. All right? And these, these are the uses of it. Just like echo. All right? Nice. So you can come here. Like I said, this is the URL, php.net forward slash ref dot strings. And you're going to find a lot of them, and you can find many examples. Just in case you need to do something with some strings, you can come back here and do it. All right? So anyway, thank you so much for watching this lecture, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.